Hi everyone, I will show you how to install Network Simulator 3 in Ubuntu operating system. Now here these are the commands what I am going to use. Uh, there are overall four steps step one upgrade and update step two development libraries step one step two is installation of development libraries and step three is installation of final ns3 now, overall installation there are three steps okay Now, my session is here. You always use the LTS version. It may be the 16.04 or 18.04. Uh, if it is not long term support, uh, after installation of NS3, execution of files, and there are, it will show you so many errors. And that's why uh, please prefer LTS version operating system Ubuntu either 16.04 or 18.04 uh, now let me start with the uh, opening the terminal now here in search you simply type terminal you will find the terminal window now first step is update now simply you copy paste these all commands you can find in the bottom of my video in the comment you can find these all commands now first update it will take some time here initially it will ask some password that administration password or admin password you simply give that password now next one is the upgrade now update as well as upgrade it will take some time now here the next one is upgrade here I am not showing you the upgrade why because it will take a lot of time simply you copy but in your system you must and should upgrade now with this update and upgrade step one is going to complete next step 2 it is about the installation of development libraries and wireshark to analyze the packet and gnu plot it would rather graphs and python programming as well as to draw the plots and q4 that is for the netanim network animator these are the major development libraries and G++ uh, simply you copy this command and paste in the terminal and enter upgrade here I am not showing you the upgrade but in your system you do the upgrade paste and here it will show you unable to locate packets of python canvas or desktop dvs rsvg and separately you can install these libraries here separate commands I am providing for you and initially you type update and after that uh, you install the python uh, you simply copy paste and after that you install this canvas and pygraph and here I am giving you some additional libraries sometimes these libraries are required you copy paste and install it now few people they will get they will struggle mm, that is step two python that will sometimes the python will create some problem that's why i'm given the separate commands you can use them now step two is completed now step three it is about the installation of NS3 latest version here latest version is 
uh, you can download this 2.9 uh, from NSNAM website I'll show you it is NSNAM simply in Google if you type NSNAM here the first one double double dot NSNAM org you'll find the download now latest releases these all are the different versions of NS3 now I'll show you how to install NS 3.29 simply download and here it will show you some link that is the link by using this link directly you can download that file but the file is in the rare file that is compressed version after downloading it uh, we need to extract then only installation is possible now here I am already installed it and here I am already installed that one actually here one more no, it is showing here one more wind mm, directory it is showing Why? because it is already extracted now here it is the downloaded one actually from the downloads I copied and paste on the desktop okay here now we you are going to work with that one after extraction you will find this directory uh, ns all in one 3.29 now i will show you how to extract and how to install uh, here i copied the downloaded file on the desktop to so do the same and one more thing here the file is on the desktop now download part is completed next one we need to extract before extraction My suggestion is first go to the desktop and and in desktop you will find this downloaded file and you simply extract it. Yeah, here uh, CD desktop and after that you copy this command. terminal paste it simply extract that rare file now this is the extracted version now simply enter into the directory uh, change di by using change directory here if you open that you will find that these all uh, all files are available in all in one folder now in that ns 3.29 that fault is also important now simply copy that cd ls means list of files now cd enter into the directory uh, you simply copy paste the directory name now I am in NS all in one 3.29 now once verify your home location uh, you are in Elite ok after that build python copy now paste yeah, but uh, now it is not taking too much time but in your system it will take time you wait 
now the next instruction that is next one is here you simply enter into the next folder ns3.29 i am already shown you here let's get up ns all in one ns3.29 here these are the files in ns3.29 now change directory from all in one to ns3.29 now here we are in ns3.29 so simply you configure this waf Uh, it is also will take some time okay sorry for this okay now after configuration here don't no need to consider these uh, red lines uh, major all the libraries are installed now the next one uh, let me test the installation of development libraries by using dot forward slash test dot pi it is also take some time i'll see it will take lot of time now simply i'm skipping that version yeah here yeah, test it will take lot of time now simply forward this pass means all the libraries are installed properly let me skip this video now here the thing is uh, everything is installed now the finally i'll verify uh, with simple example now that is here test is completed here these three commands next you need to run in cd ns 3.29 it is very very important few people they are going to run these commands in ns all in one directory don't do that okay after completion of this you simply uh, enter into this directory and after that you run these three commands here yeah, these two are completed now we'll run this hollow simulator if the result is okay means the simulation is uh, that is the installation is properly done i'll see test completed we have run hello simulator yes here hello simulator it is not showing any errors means there is no problem in the installation uh with this is the procedure of installation of network simulator 3 and overall the simulation is done in three steps the first one update upgrade after the development libraries and after the downloading the latest version of ns 3 and after that uh, build dot py next configuration of waf and finally testing and now finally the i am simulating this these are the major steps uh, which are involved in the installation of ns3 uh, thank you friends
uh, i hope this video will help you while you are installing this ns3 in your system thank for watching